I'm just looking at fish curry, so you know what it's like. You need a lemon. You take the lemon, you cut it, you cut the bums off it. Cut the bums off the lemon so you can stick this into the trout, like this. You cut the lemon into half, like this. You cut the lemon into pieces, little slices, like this. Yeah? You're gonna need at least one half, three slices per, well, three or four. Then you take butter. You take butter and your butter knife. You take a fish, 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 fish. You take some foil. You take some foil. You put the foil down. You take the fish, big giant trout. You take the lemon. You get some good chunks of butter on it. You put it into its guts, like so. Good chunks of butter. Yeah, try to lose one hand so you can use utensils. One hand for the fish, one hand for everything else. It's a big fish, so lots of lemon. Stick it up its, up its belly. Trout is just caught and cleaned, and that's all. This one was in the freezer for one day while I was traveling, and it's back. Okay, so I've got four pieces of lemon into its belly. Then take some more butter. Not as much as that, but a little bit of it. Just put it above the fish. Just on the foil, yeah? You can, that's the same as buttering the fish, just so you have the butter in there. Like so. Yep. Butter, butter, butter. Lemon, lemon, lemon. Yep. And that's all you need, really. All you have to do now is do a little fold up. All you have to do now is fold it, yeah? What you want to do is you make a bit of a cooking area for it, right? So you want, what you want to do is you have a sealed fish, shiny side foil on the inside. Yeah, and you want to make a little vacuum in there. You know, basically you want to be tight, so you cook it with the steam, yeah? All right, so I do it like this. And I fold it up. Once. Once. And then twice in the belly. And then you can just fold the tail up and just fold it up like a candy <laughs> and you're done okay now now it's ready like that fold it up like a candy here down the middle nice and flat and candy there so that's where you have to go on the barbecue so i've got two i'm gonna do another one foil Good length, just to give it some, some space. Shiny side up. Put your fish in the middle. There's your fish. This one is a bit smaller. But not too small. Mm -hmm. Alright, well, looks like I have to cut my lemon. So this is one whole lemon going on this. Yeah? Okay. Okay, butter, good chunk of butter onto it, like so, straighten its belly. Practice, pra practice makes perfect. All right, that's that. Next one. <clears throat> okay, this one may only have no, I also have, this will have three pieces of, this will, this will have three, three will fit in here, good, so usually it's about three, that's about a good size trout, so I'm going to get a nice and juicy lemon at the middle, yep, yeah, that's a small one, okay, a 
cool. And there you go. Now, a bit of butter for the top. The top of the fish. This is so to make sure it's got some juices because they're going to melt all around it. Okay. Right. Put the foil up. Put the foil up like this. Yep, gonna cook the fish now. Uh, you want the barbecue on high. On the belly, nice and tight. Here comes my son. Oh, you're a cheeky little monkey, aren't you? Okay, here we go. Fish is ready. Two fish ready. Okay, let's start the barbecue. Oh, yeah, this is exciting, isn't it? Okay, got the barbecue um, on ignition, so that's on high. Feels not too warm yet, but I think it's getting there. Take your ready fish and just place it in a barbecue, like so. And that's it, really. And now you're cooking it for about three to four and a half minutes so the big one will go for four and a half to five minutes this one the small one will go four minutes and that's about it really hey siri set a timer for four minutes hey siri Hey Siri, why doesn't Siri work while you... Once your time for the fish has come up, you turn on the side. So this has been five minutes, so I'm going to turn this upside down. So another five minutes on the side. You can hear all the sizzling. And I'm going to turn here as well. And set a timer for another five minutes. Now, time is up, fish is finished, turn off the barbecue, take your fish. Carefully unwrap it. It's hot. Use your steel hands. Or use a fork, whatever. Makes a difference. Okay, just open it. Whoa, a nice mom. Mom, 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 mom. A bit of steam coming out there. Good. Oh, yeah. Hands of steel. Look at that. Okay, good. Stuck a little bit. Good. Very good. Yeah, it looks looking nice. So, but when you have good effect, when your fish is skin is stuck to the, there we go. See how the skin comes off? Skin comes off very lightly. So when the skin is coming off like this and it's stuck to the paper, the sand to the foil means it's ready. All you have to do is just peel it off like this, and it's ready to eat. Put a fork down the middle and split the two halves. So you can tell if it's ready. If you pull it apart like this, there you go, it's perfect. See? It's coming off nicely. That means it's ready. And that's it. That's all folks.